So you can see here that I got a video on my timeline and what you can do to make it more interesting is add in elements, which is accessible on the elements tab right here. So elements are a bunch of preset motion graphics that you can use to make your video look interesting. For example, there's a web element circle right here that has a like uh, icon on it. So I can simply click and drag it over here above the video. And if I were to press the play button, you'll be able to see that there's the like right there. You can also go around and resize it right here and place it wherever you want. In my case, I'm just going to place it in the center. There's another animation right here, which I'd like to include on top of it. So I'm just going to double click on this and you can see that this is, has a download icon. So I have to download it first. And what I can do is I can click and drag it, keep it on the top. I can resize this out right here and keep it just like this. And once I do that, I can go in the beginning, press the play button. And this is how it looks all together, as you can see. So I can add in any element that I wish. Let's say, for example, if I want to add in something like camp, I can go over here, download that out. And if I were to go around and play this, that is how it seems, as you can see. So there's the camp right here. That's the element. You can go around into different elements of your choice right here. Click and drag it right here. And then it downloads the content in case it's a download downloadable content right there. If there's any element that you wish to set out, this not just uh, applies for elements, but any of the tabs right here. Let's say, for example, you go for circle right here or whatever. Let's say I'm just going to go for travel right here, just like this. Uh, then you get the travel elements. I'm just going to go around over here and go for hand drawn elements right here. Let's say, for example. So if I were to go around and I just want to go for, uh, let's say, uh, three, number three, it displays the ones with the number three on it and so forth, as you can see right there. If I were to go over here, I'm going to go for hand uh, drawn. So I'm just going to type in hand and you can see that that is how it looks. And that is how you can add in elements onto a Filmora project. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.